Discourse on BBC World News. I'm James Reynolds in Washington, D.C., and this is BBC World News America. Debates over the origins of COVID intensifies after comments from the FBI director. Chris Ray signals that the Wuhan lab, not the food market, may have been where the virus began. But other U.S. government agencies are not so sure. Over 40 people dead after a passenger train and a freight train collide head-on in what's been described as the worst rail disaster that Greece has ever seen. In Nigeria, an official winner, an outrage from the opposition as the country's ruling party's candidate is declared the winner of the presidential election. Plus, the front row seat to history. This, the coronation chair, is getting ready for its close-up ahead of King Charles's big day in May. Welcome to World News America on PBS and around the globe. We begin this program with one of the most significant questions of our age, and one which still has no firm answer. How did the COVID pandemic begin? The head of the FBI has now claimed that COVID-19 most likely originated in a lab in the Chinese city of Wuhan. For its part, though, China has hit back. It's accused the FBI of politicizing the investigation. Meanwhile, other U.S. agencies have signaled that they think that the virus developed naturally. Our North America correspondent, John Subworth, who is himself a former China correspondent, reports. Suspicions have long swirled around Wuhan's laboratories. Now, three years after the start of the pandemic, they've burst into the open once again. The FBI has for quite some time now assessed that the origin